are at Taste of Sydney Festival. I reckon we need to go in and crash somebody's door. There's, there's a, a real appreciation for small family uh, producers in Australia. So I connected that to my connections in Italy, my family in Italy. They know small producing families, um, olive oil producers, balsamic producers, and I wanted to bring those beautiful things to Australia. So it's all about family, and I know your inspiration with cooking um, came from family exactly. as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm the youngest of six kids, so we're almost like, an, we're almost like an Italian family. You know, there's never yeah, enough yeah. food in every Christmas and Easter. It's, it's not how everyone is, it's about the food. You can cut this in different ways, we can slice it really thin, or we can go through the middle, which we might do. So I'm going to actually highlight the fact that it's raw. So it is actually raw. It's a raw yes. piece of cheddar. <laughs> yeah. But you've only seared the outside. Seared the outside. Typical niçoise. Um, things like capers, some olives, an egg. We've got some uh, radishes here. This is perfect because your new cookbook, which is called Salad Kitchen, is out. It is. And people can actually pick that up too, and you can pick up all these amazing That's salads. Right. And salads don't have to be boring. No, salads do not have to be boring. As I said, just get some colourful things. It doesn't have to be all the things we have here. Whatever colourful things you like. I'm very rustic. We just we throw things on. Yeah. You know, nothing's thought about too much. More oil, more oil. Oh, come on, oh, come oil. Bring it on, bring it on. Oh, That's just oh. so we can get his muscles out for all the ladies that are here watching. <laughs> we could squeeze a lemon on this, but Ben's got some of his delicious This one's a, a six-year vintage balsamic, so for six years it's been on French oak. So there's the French influence, French there oak. There you go. There we go. So I don't know who's going to eat this, but I'm going to drink I the actually wine. think you can drink that. Um, I'm going to drink the wine, you're going to eat okay. that. This is Billy. This is Billy. Yeah. Yeah. He feels yeah. being a little tasty. <laughs> oh my god. Mmm, it's yeah, good idea. We're here at the Taste of Sydney Festival. There is so much going on everywhere. Courtney and I have just decided to crash and we've decided to crash here at Ben Fati, which is fine Italian food. Marina, this was literally got up, went to the shops and what looked good were these blue tuna crabs. Oh. I'm a real seafood girl and seafood cooks really quickly. And I have personally tasted the Benfati tomato sauce. Oh. So, blue summer crabs done in tomato sauce. They're actually Simple. Sicilian cherry tomato sauce. Absolutely beautiful. Do you know wow. what I love? All of your products have a story. Yes, you yeah. guys know well, everything and they have a story. All of our products come from very, very small farms in Italy. So, actually, every family tells you their story, the way they produce them. Oh. And Quite unique. It's beautiful. Some fresh blue swim with crabs. You need to get fresh ones. The way you can tell they're fresh is by their eyes. And of course, they don't smell. They, they smell, don't smell like it. smell like sea water. Yeah. Yeah. First thing you need to do is just get underneath that flap at the back. So it's almost like a battery opening. Like yeah, you know. And all you do <laughs> is just rip <laughs> off the <laughs> head. We can't do an Italian oh, wow. dish without some garlic. Absolutely agree with you. Now it's just a matter of with a, a big sharp knife. Oh, and in they go. There you go. Oh, we'll call it our Sicilian blue tuna crab. 
if you like any Italian family, there's arguments on who gets, because everyone wants this nice meaty bit. Yeah. So you've well, got to cut it so everyone gets a little portion. Like a little lollipop of meat. Can we stir that? Yeah, keep stirring. Just one small chili seeds out, just so we don't blow anyone's head off. So Marina, just put a little bit in. If you tip a whole bottle in, it's going to cool our pan down. Oh, that's good to start with. When I think of Italy, when I think of tomato sauce, when I think of food, I think of family. Sharing. Yeah, sharing. sharing and stuff sitting like that. down and enjoying a meal. That's and what it's so about. We grew up catching these things down Shoalhaven Heads on the Shoalhaven River. Yeah. Uh, we, that's what we did as kids in school holidays. That was our entertainment, was fishing, stealing oysters, <laughs> and putting crab pots in. And my dad still catches crabs in Rose Bay. Yeah. Um, and that's where all the water planes take off from. So my dad's the crazy man with his belly out going around in his little dinghy around Rose Bay. Posh people in Catalinas. And their big wine bottles. And then there's my dad with his shirt off putting crab pots in out the front of the restaurant. If you see a water plane going through Sydney with crab pots hanging down, then you know it's Courtney's dad. Probably from my dad. So very simple, three or four things, some flavours. Garlic, good oil, good tomato sauce, fresh crab. Beautiful. And tell a few stories along the way. You cook all that's coming, all that's out? Yes, salad kitchen. Salad kitchen, yes. This it's is all about this salads. In this isn't in it because it's I do have a crab salad in there. And you, you do? You could, look, you could let this go cold. I've had plenty of crab the next day when you can't eat it. Yeah. And it's like Chinese or curries. It tastes better the next day. So is it true, because you're from Italy, yes. is it true that Italians have a glass of wine with every meal, besides yes. breakfast? Or you have it at breakfast. breakfast. Even you for breakfast. You have a liter oh, of breakfast with your coffee. We're not No, 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 no. no, 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 no. So really, we could just drink this. We could drink this. If we uh, to this well, <laughs> yesterday what we did in our break is was actually... Yeah. Did you make Bloody Mary today? Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, we did. Yeah. They were Not getting naughty. Mary. I already know it's going to be good because of this one. Yeah. So we were quite lucky. Oh, it's so good. Oh, so good. If you were cooking at home, this is kind of like our pantry. Just see what you've got. Oh my goodness, look at this. Honestly, 15 minutes, glass of wine, music on. That is amazing. None for you, Ben. We can't eat any. So who wants some? Who wants to try? Americano, Americano, ma si nati in Italy. Sienta me non c'è sta niente fa. Gone in 10 seconds. 20 minutes to cook, 10 seconds to go.